Hello everybody, it's me, your girl Jenny Weaver, and I'm gonna lead you in some spontaneous, powerful worship. I'm gonna decree things over your life today. I'm gonna to join you in prayer as you're believing God for your miracle, your breakthrough, your healing, whatever you need today. Listen, we serve a God who is able to do exceedingly, come on somebody, abundantly, above all that we could ask or even think. That's the God that we serve today. So as you're jumping on, I just want you to begin to share the video. I believe it's going to be a powerful broadcast. I'm going to be singing the scriptures today, singing from one of my favorite chapters of the Bible, Isaiah chapter 60. Come on, it's time for us to arise. Good morning, good morning, everybody jumping on. I love you. I love all my students. Hello, good morning. Everybody from God's 411 page, thank you so much for your support and your love. Please tell me where you're watching from. Today I am sporting my favorite daughter of the king, new tank top. Oh my gosh, I love this one so much. I believe in wearing clothing that represents God. So just to have a few pieces in your closet, that would be good. But if you want it, you can get it from my shop. Man, God is so good. He is so good. He is so good. He is so good. Yes, I will pray for you. I see the prayer request being uh, put down. We're going to pray. We're going to believe. We're going to decree and declare the word of God over your situation. So please, go ahead and share. Thank you for sharing. Hey, Serena, what's going on? Thank you for sharing. Thank you, Angela, for sharing. Barbie, for sharing. Hey, Johnny. Thank you, everybody that's on here. Good morning, good morning. And I am going to attempt <laughs> to share the video from another device. It's hard. Good morning to you in the Philippines. Hello, good morning to you in Ohio. There's a couple people from Ohio watching. Come on, George is in the house. Yes, I'm going to pray for people. Absolutely. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, 
the name of Jesus, we decree the name of Jesus. Mind. Come out of the cave, 
out of the dark place today. No more hiding, no more isolation, no more retreats. My God, and it says, but the Lord rises upon you and his glory appears over you and nations, nations are going to come to your light and kings to the brightness of your dawn. Lift up your eyes and look about you. All the assembly has come to you. Come on, this is for you. I prophesy. Your sons are going to come from afar. My God. are carried on the arm then you will look and you will be radiant and your heart will throb and swell with joy look with your eyes see his glory shining look look around and see how the Lord Daughters are coming back. He's making all things new. You got off the track somehow. You got off the road that he had you on somehow. But he's bringing you back. He's bringing you back. Trouble won't last always. He's bringing you back. He's bringing you back. He's bringing you back. He's bringing you back. Trouble won't last always. He's bringing you back. He's making you new. Yeah. Your sons and daughters shall be saved. Shall be saved.
all the assembly are coming to you. Your sons are going to come from afar, and your daughters are carrying on the arm. They're coming home in the name of Jesus. Yeah, we just pray right now that God's touching you, Brenda, in the name of Jesus. I'm going to continue on because this is a great, this is the word. The word will set you free. The word is what sets you free. The truth, once you know the truth, that's how you get free. I see the comments. Trust me, I'm looking. I may not call them out, but I am looking and I'm seeing them and I'm asking the Lord what he wants to decree and declare over you. So continue writing in the comments. Continue to share the video. And I want you to get the word in you so that you can have something to stand on. You can have something to stand on in the midnight hour when I'm not singing songs over you. But you need to call on the name of Jesus and you need to remember that the word is the thing that does not People fail, situations change, but God does not. He is the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. And I'm believing and decreeing and declaring the word of the Lord over you today. So Isaiah chapter 60 verse 5 says, Then you will look and be radiant and your heart will throb and will swell with joy. The wealth on the seas will be brought to you. Who's decreeing and declaring that over your finances right there? The wealth of the seas will be brought to you and the riches of the nations will come. I receive that for my life, for my family, for my ministry, for our business, for our jobs, our careers, for my children, for my family, my extended family, my city, the church as a whole, the saints of God, the covenant sons daughters, I decree and declare and I believe that with all of my heart. Oh, the wealth on the seas is going to be brought to me. The wealth on the seas is going to be brought to my family. The riches of the nations, they are coming. The riches of the nations, they are coming.
Father. Oh, our God heals and he'll heal your child. on your prayer request. Come on. Oh, for your aunt, recovery is her portion. Oh, cancer has to leave in the presence of the Lord. Oh, he's healing bodies.
straight out of his word and you can believe that and you can change how you feel what you know and you how you see your perspective according to the word of god that's one way that you can leave this broadcast today or you could leave going she didn't call out my prayer request you can leave going i still feel the same nothing changed you can leave defeated carrying that burden carrying that offense carrying that unforgiveness carrying that bitterness or you could leave going i'm just going to stand on the word of god that was decreed and declared i believe it i know i don't feel it just yet but i believe it i may not see it in the natural oh lord but i believe it 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 oh Joy comes in the morning. Listen, I put a link for the free event in this video. It's an online two-night event. I'm going to be leading worship. I've never done anything like this before. It's with Apostle Ryan Lestrange, great mighty man of God. And the Lord gave him the title, which is The Grown. It's for all hungry people, people that want more of God, people that are saying, I know there's more out there. And we come together. It's online. It's online. It's not on Facebook, so you have to register. Secure your spot today. Go register. The tickets are free. You'll get a link in your email when it starts, and that way you can be a part. Go do it today. Do not wait. Secure your spot. Secure your spot. I'm just letting you know. Secure your spot today. Go and do that. I bless you in the name of the Lord. I'm going to be doing a webinar tonight with my students in the JW Online Academy. I do have an online academy. Currently, there's a little over 1,200 students in the academy, about 250 in the members club. It's a private um, club that I do where I teach and mentor and coach my students online. And each month they get a new study. They get lessons um, Monday through Friday. And they get live webinars. And they get a book club. And they get a prayer wall where they uh, have um, audio recorded prayers. They can just click on. They have um, worship that's in there. Uh, exclusive worship. Worship that you guys cannot find anywhere. But it's specifically there. And that's JW Online Academy. If you want coaching and mentoring, you can do that um, just by going to my website. Adriana, can you put that up there? That's JennyWeaverWorships.com. Same place where you can get my shirt. And I just want to bless you. Um, also, in the Academy, there's a free course. So I do offer that for people um, that may be struggling financially, but it's extremely affordable. Like, seriously. $20 range. So if you want courses, classes, e-courses, all of that stuff, you can find it there. Thank you, Adriana. I see all my students on here. If you're a student in the JW Online Academy and you happen to be on here right now, can you just say, that's me? That's me? Um, where did I get these cross earrings? I have about seven or eight pairs of different cross type earrings. I love them. Um, they're my favorite. I think I got these, I want to say, Forever 21. Love your shirts. Yay. Thank you so much. So any students on here, if you're a student, you're a part of the JW Online Oh, Adriana just put up the free, um, the free e-course. That's me. Hey, hello, 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 hello. Your mark looks like a world map. I know people have said that. <laughs> I see you have the nations on your neck. <laughs> hey, that's cool. I received that. <laughs> the nations. The nations. That's me. Hey, students. Look at all my students. I love them. How do you pray in tongues? You ask the Holy Spirit to fill you with the baptism of the Holy Ghost, and you ask Him for your heavenly prayer language. You 
step out on faith and begins to open your mouth and he fills you. He gives you the utterance. You begin to speak forth and he will fill you with the utterance. It's your heavenly prayer language. It's absolutely biblical. And I encourage you to do that, especially in your private prayer time. And uh, yeah, you just begin to speak forth. The Bible says that out of your belly will flow rivers of living water. And just as the day of Pentecost came, when it fully came, they were all with one accord and they were all in one place. And suddenly there came a sound like a rushing mighty wind and it filled the place that they were in and upon them appeared cloven tongues of fire. And they began to speak in other tongues. So we have that ability to do that. And I just impart that to you right now. Just receive. You want to be my student? Awesome. Um, you can go to Jenny Weaver Worships to do that. Thank you guys. You guys are so sweet, so kind. So sweet, so kind. Yep. Yeah, Amy, that's your spiritual language. Absolutely. And the Bible says that it's the way that you can build up your most holy faith. We can hear that in Jude. Building up your most holy faith, what? Praying in the Spirit. The Bible also says to sing. Sing in the Spirit. It says you sing with understanding and you sing in the Spirit. You pray in understanding and you pray in the Spirit. So there's lots of different things that the Lord has for us. If we would just dive into his word, we would find out his truth. I will be back with you. Actually, tomorrow I'm traveling. I'm going to be with Christy Nelson on the Christy Nelson Show. So I'm traveling and I'm going to do my best to be live. If I do have a few moments to do that, I'll have my guitar with me. So I think I'll be, if I go grab some coffee somewhere, and I'm not too distracting, like Starbucks, I can maybe do worship there. Wouldn't that be cool to see me do worship out somewhere in, in the city? That would be cool. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I hope I don't get kicked out of any places. But hey. All right, so... Thank you, Holy Spirit, for what you did today. Bless the people. Um, I'll say you can get this tank, Daughter of the King, uh, with a razor back. Boop. And yeah, it's a million degrees here in Florida. So uh, it close to 100 yesterday. So yeah, get your tank. And you can get that at my website as well. Don't forget to register for the live event. This video has gone on so long. Why? <laughs> Well, I bless you. Thank you for praying for me. Thank you for praying for me. And I'm going to continue to pray for you. Continue um, supporting God's 411. You can become a financial supporter. If the page is blessing you, if it's blessing your family, if your family member saw a video and they were really stirred and they gave their life to Jesus, I would... Um, you know, I just encourage you to become a supporter of God's 411 page. They're good people. So bless you. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.